access to Australia's South East Coast. The trucks will travel across the country to deliver the hay to drought-stricken farmers in the eastern states. Almost 1,000 bales of hay were loaded onto trucks in Esperance. The hay donated by farmers from across the state over the last two months. It just snowballed and it turned into this phenomenal, amazing thing. The convoy organiser says the generosity has been humbling. We've just come off a five-year drought and, you know, 2013 turned out to be a fantastic year for us. We wouldn't have got through the year without the support that we received, but this is just paying it forward. Some graziers in the eastern states have been hand-feeding their cattle. Others have had to shoot their animals. The feed is obviously what's critical for the, for the livestock, and to, to get to that extreme, you've got to shoot your own livestock, which you've raised. It's got to be pretty hard for the farmers to take. The convoy also includes 13-year-old Amelia Stone, who has raised $5,000 for toys and treats for children on the farming properties. The kids kind of get, like, forgotten or lost in it all. Um, so I wanted them to know that I was thinking about them as well. This convoy will join another coming to New South Wales, totalling 51 trucks and numbering some 78 trailers full of hay heading to drought-affected farmers. At the backbone of Australia, this is what we're all about. Nothing else, money can't buy everything, but it's just pure gestures. The convoy will arrive in Burke on Friday and begin distributing the hay, which will assist more than 400 farmers. Rebecca Curtin, ABC News.